to a new video and Dr. Mickey. In this video, we need to learn how to prepare the agar slants. My research team member will participate in this video. So before to start the agar slants preparation, you need to prepare your materials. Your materials like the your nutrient agar, for example, or any or any agar you want to prepare. Also glassware and the tubes. So you can use the normal test tubes for agar slants, no problem. In such case, you need to make the uh, a cotton stopper, or maybe you can use this crop cap tube. Crop cap tubes like this one. Actually, I prefer this one to avoid the contamination or possible contamination. After that, you need to prepare your agar media. Today, we need to prepare one liter nutrient agar media. So, after preparing the agar media. You need to cook the agar, maybe in the microwave if you have, or maybe using the hot magnetic stirrer as well, or maybe using the water bath. This is according to your facilities you have. After that, you need to distribute your media in all the tubes you have. Then you can autoclave. After autoclaving, you need to slooping the slants or the all the tubes and keep for overnight so let's go how to prepare the agar slants after the break
Hi, my name is Lau. I will ask a question why we need to prepare agar slime. The answer is to give the bacteria a greater surface area on which to grow in a tube. Hi guys, my name is Chow. So my question is how long do the agar slang last for? So actually the agar slang they can last as long as two months or years, as long as the agar doesn't dry out. A very good morning or a very good day to ladies and gentlemen. So my name is Andrew, also you can call me as Sihan. So today I got a question for you all, which is I want to ask, why do we need to keep all of our slants overnight just before we're doing any certain inoculation? So the answer actually is quite simple. So the answer actually is we need to ensure that all the agar in the slant is solidified and then we can check for any certain contamination. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Uncle En. So now I would like to ask you a question. Why agar slants is better than agar plant? This is because they can cut, prevent drying, and reduce contamination as well. Thank you. So this is the end of our video today. Thank you for watching. Thank you my research team members. And also please don't forget to share, share like, like and, and subscribe. subscribe. And don't forget to activate the bell to reach our new video. Thank you, good luck and bye bye! bye, -bye.